What is Unity? Introduction. Hello fellow learners and welcome to the digital realm of game and app development. In this course you will learn the very fundamentals of what a game engine is, why you would use one, and how to use it. We will be learning this through the Unity engine, a very versatile package that is used by some of the most successful game publishers today. Game development takes time to master, whether as artist or developer, but we will get started very quickly and most importantly, have fun. Always have fun. Why use a game engine? An engine is not necessary to make a game or app. It takes time to learn as an application and tends to take money to license. On top of it, you're still going to have to write code. So why would you use Unity or any engine for that matter? Because economization of time is economization of money. Unity unifies things, including other engines, such as a renderer and a physics and collision detection engine. It will also include integrated features such as sound, scripting, animation, AI, memory and threading management, and a nice UI. Some still develop their own engine. Why would anyone do something that crazy? A game engine is in essence recycled code. If we lived in the imaginary land of Gidanke, in which game engines do not exist, we would have to write our own. However, after writing it and developing a game, we find that we want to create another. Instead of rewriting the physics engine all over again, we can use the code from the previous game. Unity provides an engine for a variety of cases, but if you want complete control and customization, you have to make it yourself. Some adventurous individuals get something for nothing and use the free and open source engines such as the Blender game engine. I think we will reach consensus by the end of the course that using Unity is a good path to take and its learning curve and price are justified. Why Unity? Unity advertises. Develop once, publish everywhere. Indeed, the list is very extensive, and most of the code can be used to publish cross-platform. Considering there are significant differences between hardware, such as technical abilities, input types, you cannot remain completely agnostic to the platform you will be developing for. But if you're launching an app or game for Android and iOS, for example, it will be a huge time saver. Unity is also linguistically flexible, allowing you to write code in C Sharp, JavaScript, Boo, uh, Python variant, and a few others not listed here. Its most important flexibility, in my opinion, is its decentralization from what a typical engine should behave like. Unity is capable of a lot more than developing first-person shooters. It is, in fact, more of an app engine than a game engine. The only other why I can't address is your reasoning to learn this, so I will try to be as generic and fundamental as possible for you to utilize your new knowledge into bringing your ideas into the digital realm. Onward.